Kodiak 100 is great for special missions because at its inception it was a special missions aircraft and it was designed to be safe and rugged and reliable, easy to maintain and that's why it fits perfectly in the special missions role. The Kodiak has the ability to grow, I mean you're not going to outgrow it. You can adjust the seats, put them in, take them out, reconfigure the aircraft to where it gives you the operational flexibility you need. Also, it's roomy and it's comfortable inside. That's something that's often overlooked. When you're talking about special missions, many people tend to forget that people are gonna be sitting in it six, seven, eight, nine, ten hours. And the fact that this is so comfortable, it really makes a difference to the guys who are flying it, doing the missions, and they're the most important ones. This airplane is very, very difficult to stall. Uh, but it is a very honest airplane. It's a pilot's airplane. So I, I really appreciate the work that went into designing this aircraft because it was really built with the pilot in mind. The Kodiak 100's wing design is a discontinuous leading edge. What makes it really unique for special missions is its ability to loiter at slow speeds and you can also sprint at you know, 175 knots. I mean, you can be on target for upwards of eight, nine, 10 hours, uh, burning 33 gallons an hour. And what that really does for you is gives you the ability to be there when you're needed. If you can stay over the contact for a longer time, you're providing safety to the officers on the ground, which is extremely important. It's a command post in the sky, which is something that can absolutely be critical in the time of need. The Kodak's high wing design is another added benefit because it allows the pilot to see outside. With his huge window, he can look almost 180 to 240 degrees around and, and see uh, extremely well. Also, the passengers and the observers in the back have large picture windows, uh, larger than any of our competitors, and it gives them really a situational awareness ability that uh, you won't find anywhere else. The fact that the wing is actually behind the pilot to some degree, it gives you the ability to see in a turn uh, that your path is clear. It's a great safety feature and one that we're really proud of. The aircraft is powered by a PT6-34 engine, which provides 750 shaft horsepower. Uh, it's one of the most reliable PT6s that Pratt & Whitney makes. It's used in low-level operations uh, throughout the world for ag planes and so forth. And for that reason, it has to be readily serviceable, has to be easy to fix. And we manufactured the aircraft in such a manner that methods as engineers put together a platform that is so easy to maintain that you're not going to find yourself on the ground for very long. We offer 24-hour, seven-day week support. Uh, we're absolutely committed to being sure that you're in the air, and the Pratt & Whitney PT6-34 engine helps with that immensely. I've flown the second Kodiak ever made to this day. I've never walked on an aircraft that was broken. I've had 100% of the time I've gone up in the Kodiak that I was going to fly. So it's an extremely reliable aircraft from the engine to the tail. There are a number of STCs available for the Kodiak. We have air ambulance package, we have uh, cartography package, we have uh, external gimbals uh, that are mounted to the struts. The Kodiak is a perfect platform for law enforcement. With ISR capabilities, what they are today, you're able to get above audible range, uh, you're above a visual range, and to supply the support that you need for the troops on the ground or the low-level air support of the rotoring team uh, this we're working in assistance with. So the STC you see behind me is the Fargo Jet Center Universal Retractable Camera Mount System. The great feature about it is it's adaptable. So you can take anywhere from a 9-inch class sensor up to a 15-inch class sensor. And it actually is designed to be attached right to the aircraft and with an existing cargo pod. So the cargo pods that you get right out of the factory, they're just slightly modified with a hole in the bottom and Fargo mounts their system into it. It's very simple, very reliable. Here at the Fargo Jet Center, we operate a part 145 repair station. 
that incorporates into the overall organization, which has been utilizing special mission aircraft and involved with special missions for 60 years. We were approached to develop or design a camera mounting system for surveillance aircraft. The Kodiak was brought to our attention for such a mission. The people wanted a retractable system or a system that would hide or stow the camera within the aircraft. One of the key characteristics of this system is we wanted it to be universal. We can put a lot of different systems onto this retraction system very easily. We made the design so that the mounting plate for the camera is an item which is very easily removed if we had to make another one. So again, that's that keep it simple perspective of the design. We hope to see the aircraft into service into a lot of different type of mission work where they might, you know, they might need IR, they might need just a, a, a camera for photo work. I mean, there's a lot of different camera units in the marketplace today that can be harnessed in, into, the, into the Kodiak quite easily. The greatest benefit of the Kodiak 100 is safety. Because you know, at the end of the day, after 26 years of flying tactical aircraft, my mission was to bring my people home, accomplish the mission. Kodiak 100 fits that bill quite well.